Escaping into a book is the perfect antidote to winter in New England. Books make darn good gifts as well, so we stopped by Porter Square Books to find out what the staff is reading and recommending this season. I have The Little Town Where Time Stood Still, which is two short novels by the Czech writer Bohemil Hrabal, and a little bit of Don Quixote, a lot of beer, some haircuts, and a lot of fun, um, but also some melancholy that is the particular realm of Eastern European writers. Another brilliant book for someone who's looking to read a work in translation. Next, I have Lucky Peach, 101 Easy Asian Recipes. Uh, Lucky Peach is one of the coolest, most interesting uh, food magazines out there, and I am very excited. They have finally collected a number of the recipes that have appeared in their issues. Uh, I actually made a stir fry from this last night. It was excellent. Uh, so a great pick for every foodie in your life. So this is um, MAP. That's uh, put out by Faden Press. And uh, there are tons of beautiful cartography books out there. I am personally a huge fan of just sitting and looking at maps. But this one is a little different because rather than just showing maps, it juxtaposes them to create conversation. So they'll show a map of the same, re two maps of the same region, but put together by, say, a colonialist and a native, or 100 years apart, or uh, two maps by two different cultures looking at similar themes. It is great for history buffs. It is uh, great for people who really like uh, coffee table books like I do, and it's a really fascinating, interesting take on how we look at history. My first uh, pick of the holiday season is This Monstrous Thing. It's a young adult retelling of Frankenstein, and it's by Mackenzie Lee. Mackenzie Lee is actually a bookseller who works at the store. Um, so basically, steampunk, Frankenstein, Mary Shelley, if you like retellings of classic tales, this is a really interesting twist. I'm a big fan of retellings, so here's another one. This is one of my top fantasy fix picks for the season. This is Uprooted by Naomi Novik. It's sort of loosely a Beauty and the Beast retelling that sort of turns into a Baba Yaga story. It's set in sort of a medieval alternist, um, alternate version of Poland. And it is basically, if you as a kid loved stories like Beauty by Robin McKinley, this is the book for you as a grown-up. And then we've got Peaceful Neighbor. This is a biography of Mr. Rogers, looking at his activism and his countercultural role. Um, he was very much in favor of peace, loving your neighbor. He was a Presbyterian minister. Um, if you're looking for a book to make you feel good about the world, this is one to turn to. He is just as amazing as all the stories that you hear. On the practical side, we've got How to Get Dressed. This is a Hollywood costume designer applying her costume making skills to real world fashion, not just how to put together clothes that work, but also how to use double stick tape, how to mend your own clothes, how to do alterations and make it so that the clothes actually fit you. Um, lots of useful stuff, very practical, not meant for couture at all. This is real people fashion. Of course, there's probably something for everyone, and there are a few there that I'd like myself. So, Santa, if you're listening, you can find me in upstate New York on December 25th.